Now, there's another interesting one here eh, where Uzizi Godwa has resigned as a member of parliament as the letter or in this letter eh, uh, that has been released by Na African National Congress on the 25th of July 2024. I know you're probably going to ask you a lot of questions to say, okay, why was Zizi Godwa being introduced? Why did the ANC decide on bringing Uzizi Godwa? Because it is the very same ANC that have said uh, they have they have said that they they ANC said they 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 have got this law called step aside law. This is the same law that was used to get rid of other people. Anybody that was charged in the ANC, according to what they have agreed on, had to step aside. But with Zizi Godwa, just a few, few days after being charged, she was sent back to parliament. It was bound to cause squabbles. One of the things that I said about it is that I think this is going to cause a lot of havoc in the ANC. Why I'm saying that is because um, how best can I say this? I think people who are going to have a problem to say, if Zizi Godwa doesn't resign, I mean, if Zizi Godwa can be charged and still come back, it means that the president is setting up a, a local, is setting up a president in that, um, is setting up a president in the policy itself that he himself, he can get charged and still run away and still come back to the office even though he is already officially being charged. Right now, we all know that Ramaphosa is running away of or is running away from being officially charged, though this legal what is still around him, because of his own step aside resolution that is now hunting him. So he's, he's, look, he's, he's out there running away from this like a black, but it is haunting him, right? So I find it weird that he they even thought of doing something like that. I think. If the, the step aside resolution had uh, had had reached its intended uh, purpose, rather they should have came up with some um, ANC what what where they sit together and they dissolve this policy. Then this Zugotwa, then when this Zugotwa get charged, the policy is no longer in existence. But the policy was there anyway. It's still there anyway. Wait a minute. You are still here. I. This is what you need to do here. If you are not yet subscribed, what are you waiting for? Come on, good people. Because to subscribe, it is free. To like the video, it is free. To comment in the comment section below, it is free of charge. To click the notification bell, it is free of charge. To share this video, it is free of charge. To watch this video until the end, it is free of charge. Also, good people, I mean, come on, to watch the ads, it's free of charge and that's how you financially contribute to this YouTube channel. Speaking about financial contribution to the channel, you can join, become a member of this YouTube channel from as likely as 20 rand a month. You can also uh, use the super thanks party. In case you don't want to do that, guys, there is a way where you can use my media company banking details to donate to the channel. And you know what I'm saying? will bring you more and also guys want to buy more equipment so the power is in your hands please do the honorable thing as we proceed okay so let's read the letter from the anc it says anc statement of resignation of zizigotwa from the national assembly the secretary general of the anc comrade figel mbalula has received a letter from Comrade Zizu Godwa formally communicating his resignation as a member of parliament. The letter is dated the 24th of July 2024 and the resignation is with immediate effect. Well, do you think it wasn't going to be with immediate effect? I'm just saying. Duh. Because he knows that uh, it wouldn't have been a good idea for him to stand there 
uh, and because this other political people would have troubled him. But this is what they said. The African National Congress accepted the letter and wishes Comrade Zizigotwa well. That's the end of the letter. Um, you know, some things are strange, eh? Are they not? I think they are. What? The first thing to ask is, why? Like, why? Why are you... Why? You know, I'm still trying to make sense of this thing. Why? Why? Like, can somebody please explain to me why? I don't get it. Why do you bring Uzi Zagot? Zandile Kumete, step aside policy. She is, she's, look, you know what I'm saying? Uh, just to name few, man. Zandile Kumete, step aside policy, down. Who's this one? Uh, Ace Mahashule, step aside policy, down. I'm just naming few people that I know. So, what was it about Zizi Goto that, 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 that makes the African National Congress to decide that they're not going to do anything? I mean, they, they're going to compromise everything, every policy for Zizi Goto. What is it that Zizi Goto was bringing to the ANC that we don't know? There is a chance that he was probably doing something that we don't know. There is, look, I don't know, there was some sort of specialty or he has some special skill. I just don't know. I'm still trying to figure out as to what is it that made the ANC to say, mm -mm. Zizi Godwa, come down the come rain. We can't lose Zizi Godwa. We will rather go against our very own policy. The policy that has gotten many of ANC members uh, look, uh, uh, out of the uh, uh, out of out of politics, right? Today, about Zandile Kumete. If you notice, did you notice that Zandile Kumete did not even campaign? Yes, she stated that she's still a member of the ANC, but she did not even campaign because she told them, "I'm busy with my cases," and she was busy for sure. She was busy with her cases. So, what are you going to say? Nothing. It just, it worries me, it worries me that we, we have a situation like that. It really worries me. But I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to follow up. Because to me, that there are things in the story that doesn't make sense. Maybe to you, there are things that does make sense. You're going to have to tell me in the comment section below. Uh, guys, don't forget. There's a video, guys. Uh, I've just released my show. There's a video that I wish you guys, you can watch so can you kindly be merciful man just watch this video right support my other channel i'm gonna leave the link in the video description or in the comment section i'm gonna pin that link so please just uh help a brother we need to take that that youtube channel man to the greatest height ever so the power is definitely in your hands please do the honorable thing in that apart from that um i don't have much I just have this questions that I don't understand why Zizi Gotwa, she is, you know, I mean, so not she, but he is. In fact, why am I, why didn't I mention Abo Nozvio Mapisangagula who were to resign, who was a member of the National Assembly, Speaker of the National Assembly, not just anybody else, a Speaker of the National Assembly. She was there. You're telling me that Zizi Gotwa, you're telling me that Zizigoto, the ANC had to go all out for Zizigoto. You know, at some point, I remember somebody telling me that uh, Zizigoto uh, had been close to the president and or oh, the, the current fiction, but I didn't take it to head. But hearing whatever I'm hearing right now, it just makes me, uh, you know, maybe people might have been telling us the truth, but Tina, we're not gonna, we were not will willing to listen to them. As in and when they were busy telling us the truth. Well, let me leave you with how we've been discussing all the truth in this YouTube channel. I'm just surprised. But don't forget, that video, guys, is still there waiting for you guys to, whoop, to watch the video. So it's still there. 
please do the honorable thing guys watch that video